friends. I hope you all are doing great. It's me, Nikki, here to share with you how I organize the supply closet. And thanks to my friends at iDesign for sponsoring this video because they are my go-to for all things organization. So let's get started. So friends, I thought it would be fun to take you on the journey of organizing my supply cabinet because I have so many teachers that follow me on my channel. I also have so many friends that you ask so many questions about office organization. And so I want to share with you how I'm going to put this cabinet together. It was a cabinet that I kept a lot of equipment in, but that has since moved to the media room. So now I'm going to give it a nice wipe down as I love to do when something becomes empty. It's the perfect opportunity. And I love the iDesign cabinet bins because they're great for so many things so versatile they're great for your pantry for office supplies because they are clear you can see your items which are essential in a supply cabinet because you need to see when you get low on things and it helps keep things in order so in the first bin I'm gonna put things like our glue and tape I'm kind of categorizing things by like items because that helps everybody to easily identify where everything is Okay, so I have a new favorite, and it's the cabinet turntable. I love it. So much efficiency. Makes it easy to get to everything. I put our sticky notes in here, pens, highlighters. Great to make a homework station for your kids, or great for teachers to put on a kind of a group table. Also, the stackables. We know we love our stackables, and this is really going to maximize the space in this closet. And it really came in handy because I use a lot of clamps, because I use them to help clients um, with sorting and and kind of keeping track of their receipts and things and what I do is I'll usually print out whatever the clamp needs to say for the paperwork that's attached to it and so having that stackable organization is key and then I love the large one because I can fit those longer items such as our paint swatches and our architect rulers and pencils and I kind of use this here as our bin for all of our planning and then we are notebook people around here we go through notebooks like water and so it's nice that this is a large bin that I can put all of the notebooks in one bin and see when we get low. And so I have those items that are grab and go when we go on projects such as staplers when we're doing businesses and offices and scissors and staplers and all of those general office supplies. But what I love about this is I can take the sides out and adjust this organizer if I need to. That's a great money saver and it really keeps it versatile. Along with, I like for things to be where my team and my as myself can easily grab the items. So anything that has different levels is a friend of mine. And so I can put the pins in here. These are my favorite pins you all know I love these pins here and so I also like to maximize space by having a shelf on a shelf you can always double your space this way and what I love is that I don't have to put items on top of each other such as my label makers and things like that and then also using retractable shelving is always great when you have those spaces where multiple people are using it you want to make it so that everyone can get to it so whether you're making a supply cabinet or your pantry at home you want everyone to be able to look in there and get to what they need and they can easily see it because it keeps them from having to dig around and trying to find things which will help keep a supply cabinet whether it's in an office home school home office help keep it in order and friends you can find these i design cabinet bins at bed bath and beyond they are just so versatile and so many different styles which make it a lot of fun when you're trying to organize a space in your home and i do want to mention the blue denim because i know i'm going to get asked about this these are the little aprons that we wear when i'm organizing a space they're great for putting my tape measure in and label tape and scissors and all of that without getting in the way and then I love maximizing that space with the shelf because I can put the label makers here. They're not sitting on top of each other and getting damaged and it's really an efficient way to keep them along with I'm in love with the color wheel. And you guys know I don't do a lot of color but I'm loving this color wheel. So it really was fun putting this together. I threw our bags up there that we take on the go and this is it. This is the refamp supply cabinet for all of my organization or organizing rather tools and I hope you all have enjoyed joining me on this journey and found some tips that could be helpful if you're putting together your classroom or any of your office supplies or things like that you know being able to see the items easily get to the items really can help you keep it in order and keep things maintained 
So friends, another space is organized and boy, does it feel great. So thank you so much again for joining me on this journey. And also a reminder to check out iDesign's Instagram page. If you're looking for organizational eye candy, boy, they have it over there. This is my go-to page when I want to get inspired because it's just so much inspiration over there. And I'll put the link in the description box below. I hope you all are doing great. I will see you at the next video. And this is Nikki saying goodbye.